In terms of the leisure industry, uh, the high street has been pretty resilient over the last, uh, the last period of time. Uh, and we're still seeing uh, a good number of uh, growth opportunities on the high street for uh, leisure and particularly food and drink offers. I think what the report really demonstrates is that uh, retail is a fast, dynamic and changing market. And what the report clearly shows is that uh, there are changes within the retail industry that are happening uh, every year. Well, the latest report shows that the massive amount of churn, the constant turnover of companies, remains as strong as ever. But it also shows that there's been a net gain for the fourth year in a row of the number of independents. It's the only thing which is pulling down the LDC vacancy rate. But that is running out of steam. The number of closures of independents is rising, and it's nearly caught up with the number of openings. So. The gap last year was less than 350 net gain in a sample of about half of all the shops in the country. And the answer is, there's darkness at the edge of town. There's bad news approaching. If that trend continues, um, I expect that we will begin to lose independence net over the current year. I think that at this point in the cycle, possibly we were hoping for a bit more. The government keeps telling us that their austerity measures are working, we're out of the worst and things are meant to be improving. So I think perhaps we would have hoped to see some slightly better figures. Overall, we've seen a lot of improvement in the last four or five years, but the trend seems to be reversing slightly with a, with a, with a degree of net closures, which is a shame. So I think it's saying that there is still uh, a lot of work to be done. I think there are probably just different explanations for that. Firstly, there's still a lot of risk and uncertainty out there. And I think that filters down into consumer confidence. And I think that there's still a lot of restructuring to be done. Retail is changing rapidly at the moment. And some people are, are doing that well. Some people are still catching up. Consumers at the same time are getting even more demanding. They're expecting value, convenience, great delivery times, reliability, and all of that. And retailers are going to have to catch up to meet with that demand. From the small details to the big picture, we've got it covered. The Local Data Company. No retail, no The Local Data Company. Get in touch to arrange a free consultation.